Good to Millennium Honda. I'm Tommy, and you are I'm James. James, how you doing? All right, how you doing? So, James, what brings you in today? Uh, I'm looking for a basic model pilot. That sounds to me like you're looking for the 2013 LX model. There's nothing basic about that vehicle. It's a rugged uh, utility vehicle that's combined with a lot of smart functionality, as well as the history and tradition of the Honda safety and innovation. I think I got one right over here. Why don't you follow me? We'll take a look. All right. So, James, have a seat inside for me, please. Okay, James. So this car comes equipped with uh, power door locks, power power windows, uh, power adjustable mirrors, as well as a power lift gate lock. Uh, you have uh, dual stage multi threshold airbags on the driver's side, as well as the passenger. And on the passenger side, you have the OPDS system, which is an occupant detection system. Basically, uh, the airbags will uh, deploy according to uh, the height and the, the weight and the position of the uh, the passenger. Okay. Um, James, I also want to let you know this car has air conditioning, um, tri-zone climate. It has a uh, humidity sensor as well as an air filtration system built in with that. car also has ABS brakes, electronic uh, brake distribution, as well as tire pressure monitoring system and vehicle stability assistance, which is located right here on the side of your steering wheel. Uh, also, this car has steering wheel mounted controls, which are illuminated for the uh, cruise control as well as the stereo. And uh, one of the new features to the 2013 LX line is Bluetooth, which is standard. Those controls are on the wheel as well. That Bluetooth is a hands-free link. Okay. Now, over in the on the center of the uh, dashboard, you have the 8-inch IMID screen. Um, and below that, you have the 229-watt 7-speaker with subwoofer stereo, uh, which is an in-dash AM, FM, CD with WMA MP3 playback. Has a USB interface as well as an auxiliary jack. Now, James, I want you to put your foot on the brake and put the car in reverse. And on the IMID screen, you're going to see another new standard feature to the 2013 LX. That's your rear view backup camera along with guidelines. All right, now, James, uh, I want you to step out so I can give you a look at the second row of this car. So, James, what kind of car are you currently driving? I'm in a Honda Civic. Oh, good, good. You keep it in the Honda family. I like to see that. Yes, sir. All right, why don't you have a seat and just take take a look at the legroom. Excellent legroom, James. Now, also, I want to show you this is the uh, second row. Um, so you have climate controls in the second row. As I said, it's tri-zone, so you get passenger drive side and the back of the vehicle, um, which will have climate control on each side. You have vents as well, as well as a power outlet back here. And also, this whole second row has anchors for child uh, safety seating. Now, if you want to step out, I want to show you how accessible the third row of this vehicle is. All right, James. I want you to take a look. All right. So to get into the third row, all you do is put your hand in the hand, slide this forward, and this forward, and look at the, look at the room you have to get back into the third row. That back right side passenger seat, on the third row, also has anchors for child seating. All right, now James, I want you to also take a look at how the seats fold down flat in this vehicle. And I'll get to why that's important in a minute. But all you have to do is lift the lever here on top, and the seat folds down almost completely flat. Let's go around the back of this vehicle. So James, you a big basketball fan? Uh, yeah, actually, basketball, that's my favorite sport. Knicks, Nets? Knicks, all the way. All right, Knicks. Got some new players. Yeah, they washed up though. A little old though, yeah, you're right. <laughs> All right, so now, I want you to take a look. There's no wasted space in this vehicle. You got a lot of storage room. Your jacks over here. There's some more storage room over here as well. All right, James, and we also have a power outlet here in the back of the vehicle. James, uh, I pointed out before how the uh, second row folded down flat, and I want you to take a look at this. Also notice how the third row folds down pretty flat as well, forming pretty much a seamless connection between the two. I know I've had this problem when I had an SUV loading like a big dresser in there or something. It's usually not a, a smooth, flat surface. You, you're bumping into things. You gotta pretty much navigate over all that stuff. With this car, it's smooth. Stuff will slide right into the vehicle. As you can see here, you can also put the 60-40 uh, split so we can put the right side down. And we still can have uh, some capacity for seating as well as cargo. James, I'm also gonna show you the lift gate here. The glass has a button to lift as well. So loading car going in and out of this vehicle when it's not so big, it's also very convenient. One thing I want to point out about this vehicle is that on the LX, you get a standard um, uh, trailer hitch, which on 
all the other competition, such as the Ford. I know that you're going to have to pay some extra money for this. Not with the Pilot LX. Come stand. It's very easy to access. Reach under here. There's two knobs that you turn. Turn those knobs. You pull them. And there's your trailer hitch. Very convenient for the vehicle. Very important part of having a four-wheel drive SUV. It's very easy to put back. Slide right up under there. Just turn the knob. James, now I want to, I want to come around the side of the vehicle. I want to show you that we have some side impact door beams. Okay, safety. All right, and also we have breakaway mirrors. If you're in the uh, the mall, you're driving around the neighborhood, you run into something, these mirrors are breakaway. Very important. Also, I'll point out that uh, vehicle comes with Continental tires. And next, I want to I want to show you under the hood here. So this car gets about 17 uh, miles per gallon in the street, 24 on the highway, and it averages out about 20 miles per gallon. The Honda Pilot is powered by a 3.5 liter V6 VTEC engine. Um, it, uh, it has ABS brakes, as I said before. Also, this car has variable cylinder management, which means that the car is basically going to use um, as many cylinders as it needs. So car is in a position where it only needs to use three cylinders, it'll drop down to three, and basically that's going to help your gas mileage out. The car is also covered by a three-year, 36,000-mile bumper-to-bump warranty, as well as a five-year, 60,000 on the powertrain. James, why don't you just come over here, take a look. If you think of any questions, let me know. I'll be right back. Hey James, why don't you come on, come on outside to the front of the store. I pulled one up. We'll take a test drive. All right.